Hey, Rare Drops. We are going to take another look at the Final Fantasy XIV Dawn Trail benchmark. Now, my first video was of me just simply trying out the character creator. However, I didn't get to go into the benchmark. I was basically just making what my character is going to look like in those graphics. But now we are actually going to take a look at something else in the character creator that I was really interested in. A new style character that you can make and we're going to play the actual benchmark so let's go ahead and get started okay so here we are this is my character that i played around with yesterday so let's look at the new character we can make it's a female hrothgar so we have our pretty kitty lady. Let's go ahead and play around with that a little bit more. Uh -huh. All right, so Hellions and the Lost. I like the way the Lost look. I like that look a lot. All right, now we're gonna go through this relatively quick. I'm gonna make her a little small. She's a little, she's a little tall for Skullzy. You know, even the smallest is way taller than my Aura. So we might have to make her the smallest. Bus size. Tail shape. Let's look at the different tail shapes. Oh, I guess I could have just did that. So we have this kind of more like a lion's tail, more like a regular cat tail. I think I like this one. It's kind of the same as the first one just a little slimmer tail length we want long tail yeah give her a long tail face all right let's look at the face so what features are attached to the face they have really pretty looking eyes <laughs> i thought this side would be a little more out of the way but i think we're gonna go back over on this side all right so this is our first face. Our second face. I think I really like that face, actually. Third face. Are the ears attached? I think the ears are attached with the face. Yeah, definitely. And then that's the one that we started with. I really like those ears. I think I like those ears enough to rule out the other faces. All right, so skin color. So we can play around with the skin color a little bit. We have some greenish tones here. More of purple tones, the darker tones. So my favorite animal is a panther or a black leopard or whatever, but uh, Black Panther is my favorite animal, so we're going to make her kind of look like a little panther. Hairstyle. All right, hairstyle. So not a whole lot of choices with this, but we have this one here. Wait. Oh, it's the back that changes. Ponytail, bun. Oh, these choices are very limited. This one's really nice. All right, I think I'm going to go with this one. I think I like that one. Yeah. All right. Hairstyle, fur color. Let's make that also black. I think that looks really cool. If I were to stay canon to my character, it would just be like this. Oh, we have different fur colors. Okay, so we'll make that black. We can make that like uh, purple okay and then for a pattern small clothes so you can see the fat patterns a little bit better oh it also goes on the tail too All 
All right. Jaw. So this is going to be adjusting the jaw. There we go. Eye shape. I think I like that one. Iris size, large, small. I usually go with large, but let's make these a little bit smaller. Eye color, we're gonna go with our normal purple color. Maybe a little lighter. There, that has kind of a pinkish hue to it. Skull's cat. Skull's nya shade. So the different eyebrows. I guess technically the brow line. Nose. Okay. Nose. All right. Fangs. Let me see those fangs. I like the ones that stick out. I think we'll do long fangs. No, uh, let's do two. I wish I could change the color of that. Facial features. Cat stash. Oh, these are, I think, the dark lines. Oh, the tips of the ears are a part of the facial feature. Okay, interesting. So I'm assuming for the other ones, that's probably the case too. Don't really care for that on the face. Tattoo color, tattoos not there. I don't think I could change my eyebrow color, but does that change my eyebrow color? Okay, never mind. Face paints. See what do we have? Eyes. Lower. We're probably gonna end up going with that, but blushy color. Actual paint. The whiskers are too cute. I kind of want to either go with something like this. Or the little whiskers, because the whiskers are adorable. But if that's the case, Oh, black kind of works. Voice. Kind of like six. Look how good she looks. The hair quality is really, really nice. All right, I think that's literally it. Save. We're gonna save it as nya. Nya. Shade. All right.
we have completed that. So let's see, how do we... There we go. All right, that's going to take us directly into the benchmark. Oh, just kidding. Ooh. Oh, cool. Okay, so you guys can see how it's running for me, too. Ratio's a little off on my screen. There we go. Oh, that looks so good. All right, so we're looking good so far. We're looking good. Look how good everything looks. This is very impressive. I just started playing 14, like maybe a month ago. And I'm very, very new to the game. But just from like what I've seen to how this looks, oh my God, this looks so good. This looks so beautiful. There's apparently, from what I heard, the 1.0 chocobo, the traumatized chocobo. Heck yeah. All right, what's next? Oh, sounds like battle music. Oh, it's this scene, yeah. Oh, are you the vi- okay, yeah. I guess technically, yeah, you just fill in the spot as the- that the main character has. Wow, this is running beautifully, too. It's so smooth. Oh, I'm so excited! Look, you know what? She looks good as a viper! I wish you could view it as like a pictomancer. But Viper is definitely the main focus class. Look at the fishing and oh my god, everything looks so good! Like I feel like side by side, this and the current game looks like the current game looks so outdated in comparison. Which I don't think it looks bad. I'm not saying that like talking bad about the game, but if you compare them side by side, it looks like it was released, you know, a while ago. And this looks like it was released possibly this year, which of course this expansion is. I like this music. Oh, this area looks so good. All right, what's next? Oh, that area looks so good. I love like dark areas with glowy crystals. It's probably my favorite thing ever. I love insert Final Fantasy area. Oh? Yes! Oh, uh, that's the class I'm gonna be playing. Because Bando's gonna play Viper, I'm gonna be playing Pictomancer.
Yo, she looks so good as a viper. That new character design looks really good. I never thought I wanted to be a cat girl. I mean, you know, I've considered it, but <laughs> like full on cat girl. Yeah, let's go. We did it. Good job, computer. All right, guys. So our performance scored very high on this. So very good. We are looking good when it comes to Dawn Trail coming out. Uh, we're not going to have any trouble running the game or anything like that. The graphics look amazing. I'm really excited. I got to play catch up and make some progress in the game currently. So I'm going to go do that now. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I hope you stay comfy. Maybe we'll have some Final Fantasy content on here. If it does well, which, you know, our last video was uh, meh. But if it does well, then we might add some Final Fantasy content on here. I don't know. But uh, we also have a video coming up relatively soon talking about the new content I'm going to be making on the channel. And hopefully you guys enjoy it. But anyway, stay comfy. Enjoy the benchmark for yourself. And I will see you all later.